Everybody always says AI, robots, and all that stuff is gonna take over the world. So, I'm here to see if it's gonna take my job as a makeup creator. I wanna see if ChatGPT can do a better job than me. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, you know that this is part two. AI does my makeup. And this time we are doing ChatGPT does my makeup. I'm a little bit scared because the last one was, I was like, no, not my previous makeup look. Irritating, but I've got high hopes for this one. So. Put your predictions in the comments right now. Do you think this makeup is going to be cute or not? And you'll be able to see at the end of the video whether you are right or wrong. Buckle up, make sure you subscribe, and let's get into this makeup look. So, let's go on to ChatGPT. What should I ask it? I think I'm going to go, do my makeup creative drag style. Oh, okay, maybe I should change my question. I thought that was quite open and easy. Do you see what I did there? Open. <laughs> it's called, because it's called open AI. Bombastic side eye. Anyway, me the perfect creative makeup tutorial. Oh. Okay, it didn't work again. Three hours later. Okay, I finally got it to give us the prompts or the makeup tutorial. So it's titled this makeup look Glamorous Sunset Eyes. So I'm hoping this is going to be quite good. Step one Start by applying a gel primer to create a smooth canvas for my eyeshadow. I actually do have eye primer, so we're gonna go in with the NYX High Definition Eyeshadow Base. It's gonna do what it's gonna tell me to do, you know? Something is telling me that this might not go well. Okay, for step two, I'm a little bit spectacle, spectacle? I'm a little bit skeptical because it's then telling us to take a warm orange eyeshadow and apply it to the crease. But like orange? Orange? Ooh. Okay, well, we're gonna do it because we don't have a choice. <laughs> However, I would like to say I do like this one a little bit better because it actually takes direction and isn't just like... Do what you would like to do, like, like the Snapchat one. And but I don't want Snapchat AI to hate me, so I love you, Snapchat AI. Right, we're gonna go straight in. I'm using the Jaclyn Hill P palette that I always use. I'm obsessed with it. I'm using the color Feeling Myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. Mixed with my man. My man. Thank you to my man. This one and this one. I don't know what warm orange means, so I'm just gonna use orange. Bruh. It's telling me to blend. Like a windshield wipe emotion. <laughs> the woman was too stunned to speak. What? <laughs> Define a crease. I need to go in with purple. I'm gonna use Not My Journey from the same palette, which is a gorgeous color. Guys, this was going so well until I realized ChatGPT never told me to use a concealer underneath this as a base. It meant my eyeshadow ended up looking like this. <laughs> right, it's then saying to go back in with the orange and kind of blend it in, so that's what I'm gonna do. Now it's telling me to use. Go on in the outer corners with a dark purple. I'm gonna go in with the same dark purple right here. And we're gonna blend it in. Right now, I'm loving it. Now it's saying, apply a shimmery gold eyeshadow. Gold. Okay, we're gonna use one of my shimmers. I love these. It's from a small business. Look at that. She's gorgeous. In the center of my eyes. Yeah, oh. Oh, she's glowing. Like, literally, it's telling me to put it on the center of my lid, like here. My only fault to this so far is the fact that because I've not concealed underneath, a lot of the eyeshadow is blending and it's not looking that good. I like it so far. And then now it says, Lower lash line, smudge in the warm orange eyeshadow, close to your corners, and deep purple shade towards big. Orange here. Purple here. Okay, let's do that. Step eight is saying eyeliner mascara. I think it has forgot that I don't have foundation on, but it's okay. Apply a black eyeliner along your lash lines. Mascara, put eyelashes for definition. Okay guys, I've just seen that it wants me to put false eyelashes for the next step. So I'm not gonna put mascara on because I literally cannot find it. I don't know where I've put them. I have like three. So we're gonna use some lashes that I got sent from a brand. So okay guys, I will not bore you with this long tutorial of how I did these eyelashes. But if you wanna go check it out, the free tutorial will be on my TikTok page.
We are done guys with the eyelashes. Let me show you. They're so cute. I really do like them. So let's do step 10. Use a makeup wipe or a cotton pad to dip in makeup remover and clean off any fallout. Pair it with a neutral lip. Okay, so I'm guessing I'm doing all of my base on my own. I don't know why I didn't give me a base. I'm going to do a really cute base and I'll be back. Okay, besties. So I didn't add this base tutorial into this video. It is actually up on my members page. So if you want to see the full tutorial, it is up on their step-by-step -step walkthrough of this look and my look at the end. Okay, guys, I'm done with my base. I love the way the makeup looks. I think it's a little bit basic, but I like it. It tells me to do a very natural lip. So I'm just going to go for like a little pinky liner. This is from Primark. This is the finished makeup look by ChatGBT. Let me show you guys. Let me give you a look first. Just don't say it's love. So you guys have seen the ChatGBT one. I'm going to add my own little details and I'll be back to show you. And we're going to see if ChatGBT did it better than, than me, you know? So, I'll be back. Okay, besties, this is my take on it. Thirsty crap in three, two, one. Okay, so you guys saw I did that. I Okay, I'm biased because I love my own makeup looks and I did this without even any inspo. I personally believe I did it better. This chat GBT did not give me any base instructions, very minimal lip instructions. It gave me a lot of the eye look, nothing more. So based on that, I think I'm not gonna lose my job. I think ChatGPT is way better at like basic day-to-day -day looks. Oh, I love this look so much. I think it's so cute. Let me know in the comments. Do you think ChatGPT? Chat, do you think ChatGPT won, or do you think I won? Let me know in the comments and I will probably do this again. If I lose this one, I'm going to want a rematch. But if you guys think I should do a part two, I will do a part two. And as always, don't forget to subscribe because it's the end of the video. And I will see you guys next Sunday for a new video. Don't worry, the Christmas content is coming soon. So, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, and if you're not done watching, how about you check out the two videos that I've linked right here that I think you're going to love. What are you waiting for? Go click them.